Thomas Weather. The Rich Thomas Weather Network, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Hear Rich's forecast hourly on these Blue Water Broadcasting radio stations. Hey, good morning, everybody. Rich here on this Monday morning. It is the 11th day of March. The time now is 3.57 a.m. There's been uh, some heavy rain at this location at times during the night. Only two tenths of an inch of rain so far, but wet at times today with a stalled frontal system across the state. Nice day tomorrow, but the main event will be later in the week. A storm system that uh, will start affecting us start affecting us Wednesday night through the end of the week. And could it be a soaker? We'll look at how much rain could fall. What about severe weather potential? And anybody who thinks that we are done with chilly air for this season is sadly mistaken. We'll look into the future. Here we go. There's the frontal system that'll be the main player today, currently parked in South Central Alabama. It'll be the focus for scattered showers around from time to time today and, uh, and into the evening hours tonight. Notice how the showers start to migrate a little bit farther south, more concentrated across the southern counties. That's because the frontal system, which is now parked, will eventually move into South Alabama uh, by this evening and tonight and then uh, down to uh, beyond the coast tomorrow. So scattered showers around from time to time, high 71. Tonight's low. 52 north winds at 5 to 10 miles per hour today and uh, pretty calm tonight across the area then a nice day tomorrow i think it's the ni nicest day of the week spring like we're in the 70s but we're watching that formidable storm system out to the west of us on wednesday that looks pretty impressive showers and thunderstorms portions of texas oklahoma arkansas into louisiana and maybe a severe weather risk in those states out to the west of us on wednesday will it be severe by the time it gets here we don't know yet but we're going to keep an eye on it there's wednesday night Showers start to affect us. I think we're dry much of the day Wednesday, but then showers and thunderstorms uh, coming in Wednesday night into Thursday, Thursday night, and uh, the front slows up, so the, the threat of rain will be around and through, uh, through at least the early part of the day on Friday. I think we'll start to dry out later in the day Friday, and by Friday evening, we're dry, and that sets the stage for what should be a better weekend weather-wise. But the rainfall totals could be easily one to two inches for a lot of us, perhaps two inches uh, in north central Alabama, two to three inches perhaps in northwest Alabama. So it's a pretty wet system coming in. And then by Saturday, breezy and much cooler. Now I've got us in the low 60s, but that may be way too optimistic. You'll see in a moment. On Sunday, we have a cool start, but the afternoon is a little bit warmer. Rains to the south of us on Sunday. So I've got a uh, high of 76 tomorrow with partly sunny skies. Pretty nice day. Much of Wednesday is dry. Chance of showers by Wednesday night. And then showers and thunderstorms Thursday, Thursday night, and through at least part of the day on Friday with high temperatures in the upper 70s on Thursday. And then we turn cooler over the upcoming weekend. I've got us at 62. However, if you look at some of the model trends, you know, for instance, here's the European. It has us at 77 on Thursday, then much colder, uh, only in the uh, low to mid 50s on Saturday. That's just raw numbers, and it's got some 30s next week. So anybody who thinks that we are done with chilly air for the season is crazy. There's a Saturday, March 23rd with some more chilly air. The pollen count, medium to high today, and then very high for the rest of the week, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So get ready, pollen sufferers. It's going to be another tough uh, pollen week. Yeah, so we'll keep an eye on that storm system later in the week here. Ryan Stinn and I will be talking weather on CBS 8 and ABC 32 at 5.50 this morning, our morning weather chat. And, of course, our panel discussion on TV at uh, 6.40 in the morning will be live on the radio. 6 to 9, News Talk 93.1, your forecast conveniently located across the dial whenever you want it, twice an hour on the entire Blue Water family of stations. And another video for you first thing tomorrow morning at 4.45 a.m. We'll look at that storm system later in the week. Have a good day today. I'll see you later.